Okay, this is going to come directly from the isro.gov.in, right? Government of India, Indian Re- Indian Space Research Organization. All right, now we look at the second, the, the top picture on the second column. All right, I'm going to click on that. It takes me to this. All right, Valles Marineris. Everybody knows this huge, famous electrical scar on Mars. Right. Look on the bottom left. <clears throat> right. There's two craters. And it looks like there's a mushroom cloud coming out of one of the craters. Let me zoom in again. Right? That looks like a volcanic explosion. I mean, it's coming, looks like, directly out of that crater. You know, and the the plume is obscuring the rest of the, the valley, as it were. I mean, it's very weird. It's... I mean, it could be doctored, who knows, but I mean, it's on their .gov website, you know, and I would suggest go clicking the link and checking it out before they get wind of this and take it down or edit it or whatever. But I mean, that looks like it's coming directly out of the crater. You can even kind of see maybe like a little hint of red where the plume starts emanating. So I don't know if it's an active volcano there or, I mean, it doesn't give a date when this picture was taken, but I think this got there before exciting spring came by, like September last year. So it could have been any time between comet sighting spring and now, it, you know, there was no date associated with it. I mean, it's possible then not knowing when it was taken, that it could be, you know, an interaction that happened with the comet with the tail as it passed it's unlikely that an impact would hit the center of an already existing crater, but I mean, that's possible. It could have been magnetically drawn to that spot. Or it could be an active volcano. I mean, volcanoes do look like that. They send up a plume of smoke that expands as it hits, you know, higher up in the atmosphere. It makes like a bubble, which is kind of what that looks like. So either way, I thought it was interesting that it's on their actual official .gov website. So go check the link, see for yourself before they realize it's there and take it down.